guys, welcome back to Retalk, Retalk. Apa kabar semuanya? Selamat malam, selamat pagi, selamat siang. Edisi spesial masih dari Dubai. Dan kali ini spesial juga dengan uh, tema yang luar biasa. Episode yang luar biasa pastinya. Karena hari ini Retalk bersama koreografer yang paling cantik, paling keren. paling amazing yang ada di Dubai. Welcome Julia. Welcome to Retalk. Can you say something Retalk? Re- I'm so glad Re-talk. Re-talk. Yeah. Re-re-talk. Re-re-talk. Yeah. <laughs> Pronounce well. <laughs> okay, hello guys. My name is Julia. Mm-hmm. Thanks God I find the re 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 I don't know how to say that. <laughs> so glad to know this woman. She's amazing. Yeah. Um, I'm dance teacher, choreographer. So we run in dance school in Dubai for ladies. Um, then, and uh, we dancing everything. Most of uh, we learn family style mm. so we learn how to be flexible how to be grace how to dance how to control your body how to be beautiful so what uh, this is what we do in our dance school to so us coming uh, women different kind uh, different ages and we work with them and then when we start the dance classes it's become miracle in them life because dance give family energy a lot yes so open them so much and they become real real woman i can say that <laughs> because by life we forgot what it's mean to be feminine to be a woman because the women take a lot of responsibility on their shoulders yeah and they forget who they are from nature That's actually right. a lot of my followers always show my instagram especially my insta story when i have a dancing class with you so they asking me for about when you start with dancing well i start dancing from childhood mm-hmm. actually i'm dancing all my life i can say my style of life yeah and till now i'm dancing till now so more than 10 years actually mm-hmm. uh, so it's it's part of my life style style of my life yes and then why dancing because mm-hmm. I feel it's, it's what God gave it to me ability mm-hmm. to do it and to teach people to to show them the yeah. the life from different side from the dance side. Yeah. That's why um, I'm dancing and I'm teaching to dance. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Uh where are you learning dance? Oh, actually I'm, I'm learning in my country in uh, in Russia. Mm-hmm. So it's my roots coming from Russia as well from my family. Yes. So I start dance uh, from childhood from 12 years old. Mm-hmm. I was a professional ballroom dancer. Then I participated in many shows and uh, in my country and outside of the country as well. And I got education as a ballet teacher. Mm-hmm. And then I just uh, show and uh, we participate a lot of countries. Mm-hmm. We show programs and then slowly slowly I start to be a teacher because I feel myself more more confident. to teach people to give them ability how to dance and how to learn because i have this passion <laughs> <laughs> okay so uh, what advantage from dance well a lot of actually mm-hmm. yes for feminine for women said um, first through the dance mm-hmm. then women came they're not confident with themselves okay then they start to dance they look at themselves We well, look at them beauty, nature beauty. We when we start to move, we start to learn how to dance, how to control body, how to start to be flexible. We start to like themselves through the mirror, through the dance, and then that's become like exception yourself. And when you they accept her body, how she's beauty from nature, from the God, we start to then open feminine more. We start to understand who they are. Actually, this is coming miracle, as I say, because just only from like, when you accept your body yourself. you become a full and complete i think for feminine it's very for me, for feminine it's very important this is i think first the best things but usually women they feel they feeling so we talk about dance how about the stuff we should wear we should wear while dancing and any special equipment actually uh, yes you should learn you should wearing something what you like what you feel you are beautiful what you when you look at yourself in the mirror you feel it's 
it's it's you. It's mm. you feel yourself confident with clothes, what you wear, sexy, beautiful, feminine. Yes. So something mm. what you like in general. You don't have some some, some restriction about the, the clothes, but important to feel comfy and confident mm. and beautiful. <laughs> this is the most important <laughs> thing to feel that. And high heels, of course, because yeah. without high heels, I mean, the heels give it a woman like special energy, like she feels she's a real woman. I yeah. think so. That's right. Yes. So, uh, be as a teacher for dance, uh, what do you think? How old to be able to start for learn dance? Uh, you can start dance at any age. It's mm. any age available to start. You can develop your flexibility. You can develop many things ability on your body in any age. Because I had experience in Olympic gymnastics school, mm -hmm. so I have seen how people coming from different ability mm -hmm. and with good ability, with not so good ability, and they're developing by regular training mm -hmm. classes. They develop the body flexible and to start to do amazing things, start to be professional even dancers mm -hmm. who wants to continue, for example, to be yeah. more than just basic level. Yeah. Yes. What are the movement of dancing that you advise to beginner? Ah, oh, actually, the, for beginner, it's important just to understand there is my shoulders, there is my neck, there is my chest. So the first, the beginning, we're learning there is a part of a body. Yes. So learning to connect the fans, so full isolation. What does it mean? So we learn how to move on the neck, then how to move on the shoulders, yes. then how to move on the chest, yes. then hips, and yes. So yes. and then connection, waves, hips. So you start to understand how to control your body. So mm. this is the basic things because yes. the important things for me to teach people uh, basic things, and then they can improvise, they can do dance whatever they want. We just with the music, the body already can, can singing. Mm -hmm singing, dancing, I can say that, yeah, yeah. yes, okay. from base. Do you ever come to dance competition and then tell, um, tell me? Oh yes, uh, we participate in dance competition actually in Dubai mm -hmm. and uh, twice, we won first place twice, we had a group moms, mm -hmm. grand moms. Oh yeah? Yes, it was from zero and we just learned some choreography, a little bit teaching, mm -hmm. uh, I mean, uh, yes, and we participate twice in Dubai. Uh, yeah, we have, we had, and uh, we're planning uh, next year to participate in Italy because uh, in Italy there is every year the dance competition, the international. So I'm planning to to be there too as well. Ah. So, yeah. so what's the dance competition most memorable? Uh, the most famous one. Yeah. Uh, actually, there is many international competitions. Mm -hmm. But uh, the famous one in uh, in Italy and in Spain, oh. yes, usually. But in Dubai also, sometimes we make it every year, a dance competition worldwide. Mm. Oh, and right. we're trying to participate, yes. Oh, that's nice. Yes. Okay, as a professional dancer, you have to get license, right? So how you get them? Actually, I had the education. I will mm. finish ballet, uh, ballet college because I'm professional mm. teacher, choreographer with diploma, what legal in Dubai actually, yes. And I was working in Olympic gymnastics school mm. as a choreographer, so I'm educated <laughs> enough for that oh. skills. Oh. And of course, courses, every time I just upgrade myself for something new, for something new, new style, yes, some new products, so I will develop myself about that, yeah. yes. For your information, guys, first time when I came for join with this class, and then coming like a tree for moving. <laughs> <laughs> so it's like so hard for me for beginner. But yeah. the the question is when you start dancing, what the hard things? The hard things I think it's come to the class. <laughs> the hardest things to come to the class. Give yourself time mm. to not run away from first class because you need to give time like one month to try. Then body accepts the music, the teacher, the, the studio in general. Yes, mm. and uh, yes, and accept your body because important. We accepting ourselves when we come to the class. It's the yeah. first things. That's it. It's the most important. Just to come, yeah. and then <laughs> you will see. <laughs> and then you can feel that <laughs> yeah. your bones and then your shoulders have to. I uh, yeah. isolate, but your bones are like, oh. Yeah, crack, 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 crack,
Yeah. So now you stay in Dubai and have dancing class. So how about the demand here? It's not a gym, of course. It's yeah. totally different exercises uh, because for gym people you know what to do. And dance class usually uh, before the dance class was just for professional people in general. But uh, by time now dance class for everybody. But people uh, just now start to accept, especially ladies, because in their mind uh, the dance is supposed to start from from the childhood. But it's not right actually. But you can start to dance in any age, whatever. Yeah. It's an important thing to understand. And second thing, uh, in general, for lady, uh, gym, it's, it's not family energy. So a lot of uh, women coming with, bad, with some problems with spine from the gym because it's not for them, actually. Yeah. That's why the dance class is it's, uh, it's alternative for the gym. It's the best because it's mm -hmm. natural and feminine, yes. And all body is working as well. Okay. So yes. uh, who is your favorite dancer? Actually, my uh, career starts from uh, there was one dancer and she's still American, Carmen Electra. So actually it was my like my superstar star because when I uh, get a good education, I would like to develop something else, ability in my body. Mm -hmm. So I have seen her classes, Carmen Electra, and that time it's named Street Plastic Dance. So it was so exciting and I have I had go to her class and it was for me the best, I think till now she's the best for me and the, the dancer and as a teacher and actually my career start from her, that's why ah. <laughs> Carmen Electra. <laughs> what is your future plan or goal? Uh, developing the, the school and uh, to bring more people to change, I cannot say I'm not a god, but to change them a little bit and destiny because I say when you start to dance, it's something mm. changing in the life become. Yes, it's kind of uh, psychotherapy things. Yeah. You open your brain, you open your body because it's connection between brain and body. And my goal is uh, to bring more people. Mm -hmm. At least they come, they try, they start to dance in this country, on their own country, just to make them to be full in love with dance. This is my goal, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, yang kebanyakan tanya-tanya selama ini di DM, ya. Gimana caranya nari apa dan segala macam? Ini sekarang kita coba tanya ya. Gurunya mau nggak? <laughs> Can you teach my subscriber because they are always curious about how be a good dancer. But now uh, how to be good dancer in basic, just basic. Okay, you should put high heels. They're beautiful. What you like it so much. Okay, put some nice clothes. What you feel is feel so much beautiful. <laughs> So just open the music, just on the music, whatever you like. You put your high heels and just look at yourself in the mirror and just walk slowly and walk slowly and walk and walk and just look at yourself, look at your shoulders, look at your hair, look at your head. Yes, turn around and just follow the music and try to just release, maybe a little bit close your eyes and to release yourself, you try to feel your hips, your shoulders, your hands. You just follow the music as you want, as you like. But I think before you have to just close your eyes, put on music and just move as you feel. That's it. I think it's the thing, important things just to realize you are with music <laughs> and your body as well too. Yes. Just like this. Switch on music and just dance as you want i think so i think it's the best for beginning at least to start to love mm -hmm. connection with you and the music yeah. yes i think so simple things yeah if you have a mirror in your in your <laughs> home or your room and just just coming and then look at yourself first and then just do it yeah just do it look at your shoulders <laughs> look at your hips yeah Yes, yes, look at your hands, how beautiful it is. Yeah. One, another one, yes, two hands. Yeah. And just, just be with yourself. I mean, just to feel connection, your body, it's yours. It's yours what God gave it to you, yes. And you have to be proud of that because it's your body by nature. That's it, very simple. <laughs> yeah. Actually, she can she can show now how to do that. I think we can put the music and she can explain that. <laughs> we have uh, high heels. High mm. heels. It's mean a fusion uh, style. Like it's it's a style of uh, street dance, 
trichas, uh, the modern dance, contempt. So we usually uh, combine fusion. It's high heels name it the style. And also we do Latino heels. So there is uh, bachata, salsa, kizomba. So, but we don't, we dancing not a couple, we dancing a single dance. So we learn how to dance alone with salsa, bachata, kizomba. Yes. So this is a basic things what we do. And plus, of course, stretching exercises and to develop body flexibility more, we need to do a lot of stretching actually, it's important things, yes. A requirement just to send a message in our school, just register yourself and uh, bring you your all uh, nice clothes, shoes, yeah. and just you can start it immediately, yes. We have free trial class, you can come to us, register and come, that's it. Instagram, uh, uh, Julia Dance School. Julia Dance School, yeah, wow. just like that. Ya, yeah. so welcome to our classes. Oke okay guys, jadi yang selama ini penasaran sudah terjawab <coughs> sudah malam ini, oke? Okay? Cantik, <laughs> body girl, yeah. bisa nari, bisa dancing. <laughs> <laughs> jadi buat semua para wanita di mana aja kalian berada, jangan pernah uh, malu untuk melihat ke kaca karena kalian semua itu cantik kalian semua itu beautiful kalian semua itu manis kalian semua itu seksi seperti aku <laughs> oke okay guys thank you for watching see you next episode tapi sebelumnya mari kita lihat solo dari Julia
Thank you. 